What is going on everyone? This is Marshmallow Matt and welcome back to To The Moon. Uh, we're ready to pick up where we left off in the last episode. We're starting to make some progress going back into time. Um, so we can help uh, little Johnny here live out his uh, live out his dreams. He wants to be an astronaut. I got an old stuffed toy platypus. Uh, Dr. Watts. So Dr. Watts and Dr. What was the other one? Uh, we'll find out in a second. Honestly, I don't think this animal has the right to exist. Rosaline. The world's not big enough for two of you. Okay, so I gotta find enough things so that we can go, uh, requires three bars of memory links to, pursue, to proceed. Okay, um, we gotta find, like, the trigger thing so that we can go back in time and, uh, visit Johnny along the way. So I found two, I guess? I need to find another one? Oh, in memory of River E. Wiles. I got it. What was that? What did I pick up? I can go into the lighthouse now. It's finished, River. Like you, I'll be able to watch over her every day. She won't be alone anymore. Is that her grave? I might never understand why, but I stayed true to your wish. I'm sure Anya is grateful to you too. But when I'm gone, is going to watch over us. Who are you? My name is Eva. I was just passing by. Was she your wife? Yes. Her name was River. That's a special name. It didn't need to happen. Hmm? She... She didn't need to do it. But she... You wouldn't understand. I don't even understand. Okay. I just went back invisible. Dr. Rosaline's invisible again. Hmm. What did she do? Sounds like she made some kind of sacrifice or something. I'll shut up. <laughs> Received note. Oh, yeah. Okay. Is there other things that I need to find in here? Dr. Rosaline to the top. Top floor. About time you got here. I almost thought you fell off the cliff. What were you doing? Enjoying the scenery, what else? No, you talked to him. Any luck here? Big luck. Huge. Dinosauric. Huh? This place looks pretty empty. It's a lighthouse, what do you expect? Anyway, I'll catch you on the other side. Have fun re-breaking the barrier for yourself. Okay. What is this? Ah! Oh, is this the, uh... Okay, I get, I fed it three of the things that I need. Ah, broken lighthouse lamp. That was the fourth one. Oh, Johnny's up here now. What's he doing? I don't know. I don't know what he's doing, but I got all the things that I need now to move on. There we go. Let's go. Prepare the memento for travel. Oh, man. Uh, I'm making a platypus. Ideal shows the minimum number of moves the memento can be completed in. Okay. Can I just do it in two moves? Like that? <laughs> I did it. It's time to travel. Let's, let's activate the platypus. God. We move back a little further. Just enough. After we pay for your operation, we'll have just enough left for it. So don't you worry. White lie. 
That's what you call it, right? No. I'm sure we can just... S stop it. I don't like it when you lie. I calculated our finances. I know how it's like. Why do you try to convince me against my will? We need the money for your medical bills, River. I understand that Anya means a lot to you, but this... This is just too much. I mean, she... She isn't even... Do you know what makes me happy, Johnny? What? Do you? Well, I do. I just... Hope you can help me with it. River. When the papers for my treatments get here, I will not sign them. What you do with our money is up to you. But if you would grant me my wish, I want you to use it to finish building that house. And then, for every day that you live there, I want you to watch over her. Visit her. Speak to her. Comfort her. I don't want her to be alone anymore. And what about you? Happy. I'll be happy. Johnny? Yes? I made this. Tell me what it is. What? Just tell me what it is. It's a rabbit, like all the others you made. It's his wife that made all of those. What else? Um, it's made of paper? What else? Its body is yellow and the rest is blue. Good. What else? Look, River. I wrote a song. It's for you. Okay. Are you gonna play it for her? Well, would you like to hear it? Yes. You didn't have to bring the piano in here for this. I can hear you just fine with the door open. No. Oh my god. It's called Four River. Why so cliche? It's just a placeholder. Who is this Anya they were talking about? If she's so important, shouldn't we have seen her in his late memories? I guess he didn't keep that promise after all. Unless... Unless what? Never mind. Hey, that's the same song the kids were playing earlier, huh? I guess he taught them. You know what? I'm too manly for this. I'm heading on. I already got my memory links. You wanna hitch a quick ride or look around yourself? Uh... Uh, let's, uh, let's just leave. Let's just go. <laughs> let's just go. God, the music is so beautiful in this game. Alright, back a little further. Another little jump. Okay. Oh, whoa! We're very good jumpers. Hey, look what we have here. Oh, heh, look what we have here. What's the house being built? It's not built yet. Yeah. I bet they saw this cliff and thought it was not dangerous enough without people living on it. <laughs> okay. Should I go? Oh, there's Johnny. Should I help him? Should I pick up some of these, like, ropes and stuff? Just, there's his truck. Isabel. 
Nick called and said I should come over. Who's Isabel? I brought you pickled olives. They're your favorite, right? I heard about River. Will she be okay? Her illness was just diagnosed in the late stage. In its late stage, fortunately, it's treatable. But the medical bills. We can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. We can barely afford to pay for her treatment. I'm just relieved that she'll be okay, but... You don't know how much this place means to her. She's going to be heartbroken. I'd help, but Ted and I have been barely getting by since the market crashed. What are you going to do now? I'm... I'm going to tell her that we can make it. I'm going to tell her that we can afford everything. I don't want her to do anything crazy. Well, I already saw that she didn't buy it. You shouldn't lie to her. You don't understand, Isabel. If she found out, I'm not sure what she would choose. So what? If she chooses not to save herself for the sake of this place, then so be it. It's what she really wants. I really dislike when you neurotypicals think you know what's best for others. I hate when you call me that, Izzy. Do you think this is all about her? What about me, Isabel? After all these years, am I not allowed to be selfish even once? I don't want to be alone, Isabel. I'm not going to let her die. That's arrogant. I don't care. Where are you going? I'm going to pick something from this cliff to bring her back. It'll at least give her some comfort. That doesn't make what you're doing any less wrong. Nick wanted me to give you this. He said it's called Everything's Alright. It isn't. Music box. Hmm. Okay, so I gotta find the uh, the things to go back. Uh, let's check the pickled olives. Oh, that's the uh, that's the item I need to break. Okay, music box was one item. I can't go into the house. Um. What about her? Oh, I can't get to her. She's blocked. Uh, the truck. There was another one. Nice. Um, uh, I think I gotta go find him. Let's go. I'm stuck. I'm stuck on all the plants. Hmm. I can't, like, touch the ropes or anything. The music box song is so relaxing. There, I'm glad it keep going. I'm glad it keep going, not kept going. Uh, Johnny! Oh, I just got two more things, just from crossing that bridge. What's he doing? How do I get to him? How did he get over there? I can't, like, jump over this. I jumped over it on the way down. How do I get to him? Damn it! Hmm. I can't get into the house at all. Two, three, four. Maybe I can go into the house. I didn't try going straight up the front door. There it was. Hmm. All right. Let's prepare the memento for time travel. <clears throat> Alright, ideal three. Oh, what do we got here? Um, hmm. I'm 
not doing so hot at this one. Oh, that was not good. Now I've got an exact opposite. Oh, that is good. And I'll do that. And then this. And then this. Well, that was a little over the ideal. Uh, let's prepare for travel. No, pickled olives. Let's activate the memento. Moving back a little further in time. Nicholas. So you guys are really going for it, huh? Oh, is that Nick and Isabel? Yep. The construction's starting in just a few months. It's a bit of a squeeze. We had to split the payment. But with financing, we'll make do. How wonderful. Having your dream house built at such a beautiful site. You had your wedding at that lighthouse near all near there all those years ago, didn't you? Oh. That's not all that's special about it. We have a long history with that place. Well, it's good to have some good news at a get-together for once. Cheers, and congratulations, you two. Hey, cheers. Be right back. I'm gonna get some fresh air. Me too. Hmm. So they got married next to that lighthouse, but that's not the only reason why that place is special. There's more still? Well, buddy, it's sure been a while, hasn't it? Who knew how hard it is to get across a few cities nowadays? That river is still so quiet, huh? Eh, she's actually been talking of at home, and with Isabel. I guess she's just not used to you. <laughs> so I'm the bad guy here, huh? Oh hey, did you tell River that thing from back then? I did. So how did she take it? For the most part, she took it well. But something bugs me. What? Ever since the incident, she's been making these strange ribbit- no, <laughs> ribbits. Rabbits out of paper. Origami rabbits? Yes, lots of them. <laughs> I used to fold origami animals for my daughter all the time. What's wrong with that? I don't think it's the same thing. She's been doing nothing but making the same rabbits day in and day out. Our house is literally filled with them now. Didn't Isabel say something like that is a common trait? Uh, with River's condition? Yes, but something doesn't feel right this time. When I ask her about it, she never answers. Instead, she gets this distant look in her eyes. It's almost, it's almost as if she wants something from me. And the strange thing is, I feel like there's something I owe her, too. Have you asked Isabel? Yes. She said she talked to her about it, but got nothing. Hmm. Well, I'm certainly not one to inquire, but I'll tell you this. I've known you since middle school, and you're notorious for overthinking. That's like me. Definitely an overthinker. You're probably just imagining things. There's no need to get too worked up. Usually when someone says that, something's always wrong. <laughs> That's what an overthinker says, but I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. You're probably right. Probably. I'm always right, John. Alright. We're just awkwardly watching from the table over here. What do we got? A bolo soup? Uh, wait, so even if, he, if he, even if he himself never knew what was up with those rabbits... Forget about those stupid rabbits. We've got bigger problems. It's a confined memory and there's no mementos anywhere. Don't worry, we can probably draw one out of him. How? Leave it to me. I just gotta give the bartender a quick visit first. Hello, barkeep. Hey there, can I get you anything? hey oh, can I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? Sure, cash credit. Check. Er, I'm sorry, we don't take checks. Oh, just put it on my tap then. Wait, does that mean you don't have any money? <laughs> You're so getting resetted. Hey there, can I get you anything? Hello, can I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? <laughs> sure, cash or credit card. Just put it on my tap. I feel like spending big today. Oh, thank you, sir. <laughs> You can just reset any act interaction with someone. Uh, here are your pickled olives. Thanks, bro. You'll be getting an enormous amount of tips today. Thank you, sir. You're such an ass, Neil. <laughs> oh, loosen up. Okay, we got pickled olives. That's one thing. What's this paper in the corner over here? Oh, nothing. Um. 
Should I give them to him? Why, is that a bottle of pickle pickled olives you're sporting? Yeah, are you a fellow olive lover? <laughs> Indeed I am. I just got a fresh bottle of them myself, in fact. Mind if I join you? Sure, why don't you grab a seat? We'll down a bottle together. <laughs> oh, yeah, that sounds just swell. Ava, disable taste simulation. Now! Oh, Neil, I don't think I feel like it. <laughs> you gotta eat those. I'm so gonna get you back for this. So that's how we got our first toaster. Oh ho ho ho. Ah, act. <coughs> ah. You okay there? Yes, I'm just savoring the amazingness of pickled olives. They're wonderful, aren't they? Yeah, I just can't understand how anyone could <laughs> find such things to be disgusting. Take your time, we've got two bottles left. Making progress. So I said, hey, that's not right. And they totally agreed. Got another story out of them. <laughs> and you know what else is wrong with society today? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I actually have it right here. Why? May I see it? Uh, okay. What is that? Here it is. And freeze. Finally, dear lord. How how are the olives, Neil? Oh, shut your mouth. <laughs> okay, can we? There's a thing, and we got five uh, mementos to put in there. Wait, don't you dare! Don't worry, sheesh. See, I'm doing it by the books. <laughs> Hulk smash! Is that by the books, Neil? Seriously? I'm trying to get into this, and you're ruining the mood. <laughs> totally worth it. Alright, let's prepare the memento. What is this? Is this the sheet of music? No, it's like a letter. Um, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I can't see which ones are, like, white and which ones aren't, you know? It's, it's tough. Let's do this. And this. And this. Oops, I clicked the wrong one. Oh, can I not click those outside ones? Oops, I'm just wasting moves now, damn it! Okay, here, do this one. And then this one. There, I'm done. I was trying to click these uh, outside ones. Alright, let's prepare. Activate. Let's go to another step back in time. Oh, we're into the brown-haired stage for Johnny now. No more gray hair. What was that letter on the lighthouse? Crikey, nutcrackers! You aren't Australian. Who cares? We're like 20 billion nanometers off the ground and standing on a damn flagpole. Just jump down. It's not like you can be hurt here. Are you kidding me? It's a freaking skydive! You can't stay on here, you can't get off. God, I hate when this happens. I swear, if this play- Did she kick him off? Ava, what the fuuuuck? <laughs> Wuss. <laughs> River. Why would they abandon her like this? I suppose she's just no longer needed. No longer needed? By ships, I mean. You know how it is, now that everything has GPS and all that. Look, River. This place means a lot to me too, and I've been thinking. In our current state, things have been pretty stable. If we save well in a few years, we can afford to build a house on top of here. It's going to be a squeeze, but I'm sure we'd be able to see her from the window! In the morning, at night, we'd always be nearby. And, and we could walk here anytime. She'll never be alone again, John! I'll be able to watch over her every day. 
Yeah, we will. Oh. Good for them. You gotta be kidding me. You remember what happens, don't you? It's like watching a train wreck. The ending isn't any more important than any of the moments leading to it. It's true. The ending isn't any more important than any of the moments leading to it. There's a quote for life. The important thing is that it's over here. That, oh, the, the important thing is that over here, they're happy. Let's move on. Okay. We need to gather some uh, mementos. Wait a minute. They were referring to the lighthouse as Anya, weren't they? I suppose so. Then that river, she declined treatment for the sake of a lighthouse? Isn't that a bit too extreme? I've seen Stranger Things in the course of the job. Me too, but uh, I can never wrap my head around it. It's none of our business anyway. She's not our client. Alright, we got a note for Anya. Nice. Alright, let's keep looking around. See if we can find more stuff. Oh, what the hell? Is this them walking up there? Or are these the neighbors going up there? Nick and Isabel? Are they coming up? No? Did I leave too soon and they didn't make it? I don't know. I don't know what just happened. We'll keep walking. Oh, I've got all five of the things. Um, do I need to go back up to the lighthouse now? Yeah, I think so. Okay. God, the soundtrack is beautiful. I just want to listen to this in the car all day. Have a bad day, just turn on the soundtrack to To the Moon. Um, no. Where's the thing that I can activate? I can't activate anything here. Okay, there's got to be a memento somewhere. Something that I can prepare for time travel. I can't go this way. Hmm. Something over here. No. No. Had to have been leading me down here for a reason, right? I can't go any further in the street. Where am I supposed to go? Oh! Is this the paper bunny? Found it! Oh, that was hard to find. There's all of the stuff. Let's prepare. Prepare. Okay. Um. Ideal five. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna happen. Uh, let's do this. Very good. And then this. And then this. I did it. I did it in five. Nice job, Matt. All right. Let's activate. And let's go back even further in time. River! getting even younger and younger. Should I look at anything in here? Is anything something that I need to look at? A yellow paper rabbit. Dear Lord, not again. Oh, that got me a uh, one of the things I need. Nice. Okay, let's follow John out of here. Um, make sure I can't interact with anything here. This is a little room. Ah, oh, nice. Where did they go? An old baby grand piano. 
How the heck did they move this thing upstairs? Who knows, but I bet it'd be a piece of cake for the TARDIS. <laughs> Not really, you can't even get it through its door. <laughs> hmm, true. Well, that settles it. Moving pianos is a pain in the arse for everybody. It'd probably take an entire episode to get it inside. I wouldn't mind seeing such an episode. <laughs> Me neither. It sounds pretty epic. <laughs> that Doctor Who talk? Okay, what's this? New boxes of plain paper. Uh-oh. I think I know where this is going. Yeah. It's gonna be some, uh... It's gonna be some rabbits pretty soon here. Anything else in here I need to interact with? No, okay, let's keep going. Oh, God. You went out for a haircut this early in the morning? What are you making there? Rabbits. Did you see the rabbit I left for you? Yeah. Tell me about that rabbit. Huh? Describe the rabbit. It was yellow. Um, <laughs> it was yellow. What else? A bit puffy? And? Well, it's just a paper rabbit. I don't know how else to describe it. You're acting strange, River. Is something wrong? River? Hmm. I don't know about you, but I'm getting some inverse deja vu. I think I know of her condition, but this is rather odd even for that. You think she's... Do you? Perhaps, who knows? But like you said, she's not our client. Let's just get what we're paid uh, for over with. Okay, let's find the rest of the stuff in here. Many long strands of orange hair. She cut her hair herself? Oh god, that's scary. Um, and then there's the platypus again. Good old platypus always around. That's the thing I need. Okay, there's one more. So this is the day she started it, huh? Alright. Well, let's travel back further in time. We're making good headway here. Prepare the platypus. Ideal three. Oh man, this is getting harder and harder. That's what she said. Okay. Let's do... Oh, I don't know. Let's start with this. Holy shit. Yep, I did it in three. Look at me go. Alright. Platypus, let's fly. It's so weird seeing, like, a story in reverse. I think this is a good stopping point for this episode of To the Moon. I'm really getting into the story. I've really enjoyed it. It's, it's such a, like, a cute, like, story that really draws you in. It's so sweet, and uh, like I said, the soundtrack fits it perfectly, and the soundtrack just draws you in even more. I can't wait to see how this story ends. What it, like, there's questions that keep popping up. Um, what was the other special thing that happened at that lighthouse, like, on that cliff? I know that they got married there, but what else? What, what's the other reason why they wanted to build a house there? Uh, and then also, can they fulfill Johnny's wish? And he doesn't know why he wants to go to the moon. Are we going to find out why he wants to go to the moon? Uh, I'm sure in due time, in due time we'll find out. But for now, that's going to be all for this episode of To The Moon. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, do me a huge favor and hit the like button, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye!